Now, when students need to leave the classroom, you want to think about what is the standard operating procedure for that activity. So are they going to the office, nurse, bathroom, etc., any of those locations? Here are some questions to think about. How will students ask to go to the bathroom? Will I have a scheduled time for breaks or bathroom? Um, can the students go alone? And so on this sheet, this is your reference for all of these different activities that you can use to help you. Again, you will not use all of them. You're just going to pick which one's going to work best for your students in your classroom. This one is a tracking log. And so I use this to keep track of activities. So if you just use this over here, you can have students tell you where they're at. It also timestamps it so you know what time they left. The next one is a sign out sheet. So my students might just have a PDF and this is on a clipboard. They write the date, their name, the time, and then the time they came back in. Okay. I like to kind of keep track of the time out and time in just so if there is an issue, I can really start to see patterns of when they're going or um, how long it's taking them to go to one of those different locations. A Google Sheet. Um, so maybe I have my students fill out this go ahead and make a copy of it, this Google form, and then they let me know what time they went out and then maybe time back in. Okay, so again, they would fill this in and out. Maybe I want to use a bathroom pass where the students have a physical pass that they pick up to go to that bathroom or wherever they need to go, and maybe they set it on their desk. I've seen some teachers do that. Some students take this with them, so maybe you put it on like a lanyard. I've also seen teachers where if they're not teaching and the pass is available, they can go without asking. So again, thinking about do you want your students to ask? What kind of setup do you want to use? This page just has some examples. Um, so maybe students use like a signal to tell you that they need to go. Maybe students just fill out a Google form. OK, so all of these different ideas are here. And again, this is a working document. So as we find resources or as you share resources with us, we will add them to this document.